Adam De Silva is here and we're going to be making a beautiful Sunday with lots of gelato. Yes, my gelato, Boca gelato. How exciting. Yeah, it's amazing. So we've got some um, nut crocante. So we've okay. got using some hazelnuts, which I'll get you to start doing. Yes, please. So all it is is a bowl of nuts, some sugar and some water. Okay, we just mix it all together. Mix it all together. So simple. On the tray, in the oven for about 10 to 15 minutes. So what does crocante mean? Crocante means crisp, so crispy nuts and nothing mm. better than gelato, crispy nuts, all those different textures, yep. nuttiness. So the next thing is a fudge sauce, mm -hmm. but pop the crocante into the oven, okay. about 10 to 15 minutes, 160, and the sugar is going to caramelise and make it all nice and crunchy. Mm. With the fudge sauce, this is actually a dairy-free sauce. Right, OK. So we've got the sugar. We also need some chocolate, so okay. dark chocolate there we've got. Or you can use milk chocolate or you can even use white chocolate. OK. So I've got the sugar, I've got some water here. Mm -hmm. We've got glucose, which is not necessarily used at home, but it's a great it's a yeah. great addition to all pastry things you do. And you can find it at all supermarkets. So Correct. it's like that wonderful sugary goodness that really stabilizes any Does. type of sweet sauce like this fudge sauce. And it gives it that gorgeous gloss too, Correct. doesn't it? You know, I find with a Sunday you can buy all these elements, um, you know, we've got honeycomb, we've got fudge sauce, but making everything from scratch, I think there's the romance behind it of making a real old school sundae at home. Really Ama good quality ingredients. Amazing. So I'm just going to chop this chocolate up with a serrated knife. Yep, you can use a serrated knife or you can even grate chocolate you can. as well. I just find the serrated knife just cuts through it so much easier and it's safer. That is an amazing job. So I've got the mixture here, we're going to add the chocolate and just stir it so it's nicely mixed. Okay. Big handful. Look at that. Oh. I could just eat this whole pot. I oh, know. I love how you've made a lot. <laughs> <laughs> and then just let the chocolate melt mm -hmm. on a low to medium heat. You don't want to burn it, just yep. to bring it all together. Look at that. It's already coming together. Look at that. Delicious. <gasps> so good. <laughs> so the next part, which is the most exciting part of this yes. Sunday, honeycomb. We're going to get similar ingredients. Yes. We've got sugar here. Mm -hmm. So nice wide pan. Nice wide pan or yep. pot. Yep. And again, we've got some glucose. Okay. And we've got some honey. And we've just warmed that up in the microwave, see? It's so much easier to pour. And then some water. Okay, some water. And then we just gently stir this all together. And the key is to bring it to 160 degrees. Okay. Yes. And that's when it will reach the right caramelisation. Mm -hmm. And this is when you do want to invest in a sugar thermometer because you want the accuracy of it just so it gets to that optimum temperature before we add the bicarb. All right, now it's at 160 degrees and you've got to move fast and it's really hot. So with a whisk, mm -hmm. put the bicarb in, and I'm going to stir it. Pour it, pour it, go, pour it in. Ooh, look Just at that! Just explodes like that. <laughs> oh. That's amazing. Just pour it out evenly onto a tray with baking paper. It looks like hot lava. It's fantastic. Mm. But be careful. <laughs> do not touch this. This is hotter oh, no. than oil. Okay. And don't don't touch it because you just don't want to ruin those air bubbles there. Oh, that is so impressive, Adam. And now we just need to wait for this to cool completely to firm up. Now it's time to assemble the sundae. Okay. So I grab some of the crocante, we'll put on the on the base there. I'm gonna scoop some gelato. I've got three flavours here. I've got pistacchio, mm. made from Italian oh. pistachio nuts. And you know it's a genuine pistachio gelato when it's that colour. If it's that bright green colour, no good. there's probably some colourings in it, so this one's the real deal. We've got some <gasps> vanilla bean. Yes. And we've got some oh! strawberry. <laughs> so pretty much the colours of the Italian flag. Oh, I love it. <laughs> Very nice. Just do a nice big scoop because I think this is, um, well, this is just going to be for me. Oh, wow. And I'll just break up those nuts a little more. And then you can just layer it. It's up to you how you want yeah. it. If you want more nuts, you want more sauce. I feel like a little kid again. I am a kid, so. <laughs> <laughs> and your gelato, it's made every day? They're made every, From scratch. They're made every day. Yep. No powders, mm -hmm. all natural. Yep. So you got to consume it straight away because there's no preservatives. <laughs> all right. All right, let's go. Some fudge sauce, mm. just lashings of it all around. <laughs> 
go some amarino cherries. Mm -hmm. And the amarino, it's it's almost got this. It's very hard to describe, isn't almost it? Almost almondy. You almondy, said. or yeah, it is. Yes, absolutely. Put some of that on there. Wow. Oh, now you're really showing some off. Some crocante. More crocante on the yeah, top. Yeah, on okay. top. Let's be indulgent here. Sprinkle that over the top. Some honeycomb. Mm. Break that up like that. Yeah. And then we'll have a couple of dollops of cream. <laughs> it's a Sunday. Just, it has just, to have just, cream. Just cream, correct. Have to have a bit of cream. Yeah. Just some whipped cream. On the side there. Garnish it with some Bocca wafers here. And there you have the Bocca gelato Sunday. Made yeah. especially for you, Justine. <laughs> So good. Shall we dig in? Sure. Okay. One little spoon each, one for you. I'm going to start with my favourite flavour, which is pistachio. Of course. Mm. And the chocolate fudge. I'm going to go pistachio as well. That is outstanding. You're the best. Thank you know you. it. I know. You Thank know you. it. Thank <laughs> you.